Hey everyone, I hope you're all well. Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Seppi. This is my mum. Hello everybody. And we are off to an appointment and then after that we're going shopping in Central, doing some Christmas shopping. And we thought we would bring you guys along with us. Do you want a song, mum? Yes, of course. What song? Ishqa Qadimi. Oh, we're not listening to that again. That's not the last year. Oh, wait, who sings that again? Hamid Homai. This isn't it. <laughs> this is your song. That's My mum wants chocolate. Hello everybody. <laughs> you already said hi, you can't say hi all the time. We're in Salvages. This is the chocolate bit. She's gonna pick her fave. Which one which one's your favourite? Uh, dark. Yes. Light year rose. Yeah. Yeah, that's a no from me. No. How pretty. So, where are we? This is James Street behind Selfridges. And this is one of my favorite Turkish restaurants in London. We've come for a date. Hey, Roshan has that in. You're so gorgeous. Oh, I love you. I love you too. This is the chicken baby and this is the aubergine reader. You have to try it and give us a review because this is like my fave. So you guys, I have just come home and you are not going to believe what has happened. The tree has collapsed. Genuinely, we just moved the carpet out of the way because it's on the floor and we've been sweeping but yeah, it's fallen. So our theory for this is that maybe we decorated it one side heavy. No idea why on earth that is the case, but yeah, now we need to lift it and put it back into place. Super, super weird. So I just got home. I've actually had such a long day. Um, I woke up and I had quite a positive start to the day. I studied, I went to uni and I went to a meeting by Narcotics Anonymous. Um, and they basically gave us a talk and a demonstration of how they carry out their, their meetings. And um, it was actually really, really helpful to watch. I don't know if I've explained this by the way that I'm on psychiatry now so you know addiction is one of the things that we cover and it affects so many people and it's a difficult one because as like a, a future doctor or a medical student you don't want to come in and try and help someone with their addiction and seem condescending or like you know you can't relate to them so they you don't want to make them angry in any way i don't know if i'm making sense or not but they basically explained to us that like the people who came and dem uh, gave the demonstration and said that they run the meetings are all people who have been addicted to drugs before and alcohol um for them is counted also as a drug so it was so interesting to see how they carry out the meetings and they were saying that you know it's so important to just um whether you want to get clean or not um just to make sure you keep coming back because that will help you towards the end goal which is to get clean um and they were saying that there's a lot of people who aren't aware of it so now that i have this platform and even however many of you who watch it hopefully you know I, ho I pray for health for all of you but if you know anyone who is affected um by addiction to any drugs or alcohol um then definitely i do recommend narcotics anonymous because all the people who were there um who were giving us this demonstration were all previous well they they call themselves addicts for life because 
the addiction never goes away it's just the fact that they the fact that they're addict they say doesn't go away it's just the fact that they learn to detach from the addiction to the drugs and it's just really interesting and they were all saying that that's the what saved them and they wouldn't know where they would be without it so you know if if you guys know anyone who you think would benefit from it then you know i hope that my platform helped you guys to see that because it's really important and being on psychiatry makes you think so much about your own mental health the mental health of your friends and your family and having someone to talk to and i think the reason why I'm explaining my day is because after that talk I also came home then I went to the gym and I was having a positive day and then my mood just went really bad um, and if I wasn't vlogging every day for vlogmas you guys wouldn't know this because you guys just see the cheery me but yeah I just I didn't feel as I don't know jolly as I usually do and I feel like it's important for me to tell you guys this as well <laughs> Because, you know, don't think that everyone's, you know, living the most chilled out life and you're the only one who stresses because we all stress or we all get down, like, like we all have like down moments or some people even have like down days and stuff. But, you know, it, just remind yourself that this too shall pass, you know, it's one of the, the best old Persian proverbs, this too shall pass. So try and think on the, on the bright side of things. But yeah, just be aware that, you know, not everyone's always jolly 24-7 and that's fine as well. But mental health is really important and um, I just want to spread that message across my channel. And yeah, other than that, psych placement is going good. Also, how cute is this jumper from Zara? I stole it from Seoul and this makeup is from the morning. It's so gross. So I'm giving my mum a makeover and I like this skirt, you know? Yeah. Yeah. Thing is you need to wear it with a plain top. Yeah, we're in Selfridges. So they don't have this skirt in her size. This is one size too big. But we can go to another store and get it. I like the top you're wearing it with as well. Did you try it with the other top? No. Try it on, I just want to see what it looks like. I'll ask him if he has. I had it in her size, look how much nicer. I love it. Wear that jumper on top. No. Pretty. Does she look? Oh my god, I love it. You're so adorable. I love it. has got like Christmassy and you can wear it with jeans. I picked out new jeans for her. This is what it looks like with jeans. So, we're at Selfridges, round two. Yesterday was quite unsuccessful, but today is more successful. She chose this herself and it's a solid no from me. Take it off. Okay, let's go. The last thing that's left to try is that top that I asked you 10 times. <laughs> try the top, mummy. Successful shop. Oh, she needs me to carry it all. My mom's saying Gucci has Persian rugs. That is funny. She's right. You guys, look at this. Wow. It's definitely winter and Christmas time here at Oxford Street. Look, it looks like a picture. My mum went into Zara um, and she's coming out now. We want to go to Mango. And it's the dealio right now. Just waiting for her. <laughs> Did you get some more stuff? Yes. <laughs> Look how pretty, mummy. Everywhere looks so pretty. Oh, wow. I was showing the vlog. Looks if you go in the middle because people there. So pretty. 
I think everybody they come for uh, Christmas dinner. <laughs> Maybe, but yeah, it's That's very quiet. It's quiet. <laughs> and it's freezing, by the way. Like it is. my hands are so cold holding up the camera. And I hope you guys appreciate this. If you do, give it a thumbs up. <laughs> it's better we go and put uh, those things in the car. Yeah. <laughs> Look at all the Christmas windows and display. This is Selfridges for any of you guys who are not from London. Hello. What's a bar called? We're at Nat. So North Orderly Canteen. It's so pretty and it's got all these like Christmassy decorations. And it's on a road called North Orderly Street. You look pretty. <laughs> so second night in a row, Mum, E and I are having dinner together. Um, we're very hungry. I've always wanted to try here. And um, Shout out to my friend Anuj, her blog is called AKR Blog and we have really similar taste in food, like we like all the same stuff and she always comes here so that's why I'm here today. I really want to try it out and I'll give you guys my review. So we got the burger, mac and cheese, fries and chicken. Look at all this. Are you excited? I forgot to give you guys a look into today's outfit, but I'm wearing this new top from Forever 21. It's like a crop top. Um, I'm wearing a bralette underneath it, and the skirt is also from Forever 21. I'm kind of in love with this style of skirt recently, and I wore it with knee-high boots. If you guys want to see how I dressed it and stuff, then you can see that on my Instagram, Persian Bunny. Um, I'm much happier today. I'm in a really good mood, and I hope that you guys all have a really good day. The weather's dropped so much in London. We have two extra heaters on in our house because it is freezing. So everybody, please stay warm. If you're from London, stay warm. Yeah, I'm feeling much happier today, and I'd m rather give you guys a more fun vlog to watch than just something for the sake of it, which is difficult about vlogmas and daily vloggers. I really rate them for like coming up with stuff every single day, it's kind of difficult. But I'm trying my best, it is difficult because I do go to uni as well. But I hope you guys are enjoying my vlogmas so far. If you are, let me know in the comments. And I have a fun surprise for you tomorrow. I've planned tomorrow's video since last week. So I hope you guys are looking forward to it as much as I am. I love you all so much. I'm just going to go put PJs on and edit this for you. Good night.